Hi guys, say you'll be using Inkscape and Draft Site to engrave a logo onto, well, any, anything you want with a CNC router. First, open up your bitmap type file and import it into Inkscape. Center it up there and then use the trace bitmap function. All right, get that in there. So it's up, press OK. Move that to where you want. Now you'll separate the traces from the bitmap and actually delete the bitmap part. And then you'll want to save it as a DXF file. Once you get that saved, open up DraftSite or, or AutoCAD and open up the DXF that you've generated. Once you have this done, you know, it's in, it's in DraftSite or AutoCAD. You can play with it, you know, do whatever you want with it, shrink it, shrink it, grow it delete segments, you know, whatever. So in this case, though, this for the second logo, I actually had this in SVG format, which is a vector format. You see this, you open up with Inkscape, you've already got your vectors all around here. All you have to do is save it, save it as a DXF file, which in this case, I think it'll be a release 13 DXF, which is just, just fine. So once you have this, open up, uh, or I guess name it, whatever you want, say OK, and then you want to open it up with uh, with AutoCAD again or DraftSite, whatever you want, depends if you want to pay for it or not. DraftSite is free, which is nice. Open it up, and then you've got your logo, do a zoom extents, and you can do whatever you want with your logo. After this, you can import it to CamBam or whatever other CAM program you have um, and actually do some engraving with it. That's the results, and you can see more at jcopro.net.